The Rottweiler is a fantastic breed of dog that is sometimes misunderstood. When you get to know and live with the breed, you'll realise he's not just a guard dog. The Rottweiler temperament is caring and kind, and despite its size, they are built on love. Hi there, and welcome to Dog Joy. Today we have another entry in the Deep Dive series. We will be looking at the beloved Rottweiler, which no doubt you have probably heard of before. Stick with us to find out why this excellent dog would be a perfect fit for you. History The Rottweiler's history connects it to one of the earliest canine breeds. According to Roman historical documents, the Rottweiler is a direct descendant of the Drover herding dog. It was a famous dog breed in ancient Rome, and it was often used as a guard dog, not just by shepherds, but also by the Roman army. The name Rottweiler originated from the German town Rottweil, which was founded by the Romans in 73 AD. Years later, the establishment grew into a town noted for its red-roofed Roman villas. Rottweil approximately translates to Red Villa. Rottweil rose to prominence as a significant cattle herding location in the early 1900s. The Roman drover dogs had proven their worth in town as livestock herders. The Rottweiler, like its forefathers, became known for its strength, dependability and enthusiasm to work. Travelling butchers used Rottweilers to guard their money sacks tied around their necks in the past. They eventually grew so popular in the region that they were used for nearly everything including cart pulling, home protection and livestock herding. After railroads were created and trains became the primary means of carrying animals and meat to market, demand for the breed fell. Looking into the Rottweiler's history reveals that demand for the breed peaked during World War I, when this breed began acting as a police dog. Rottweilers were the ideal breed for this duty because of their search and guard abilities, as well as attributes like obedience and discipline. During World War I, Rottweilers served in a variety of capacities including messenger, draft, guard and as rescue dogs. On January 13, 1914, the first Rottweiler club in history, the Deutsche Rottweiler Club, or also known as the DRK, was created in Germany. On April 27, 1915, the Süddeutsche Rottweiler Club, or the SDRK, was founded and it later became the International Rottweiler Club. At first, the two clubs had opposing goals and ambitions. The DRK's purpose was to breed working dogs without focusing on the dog's morphology. In 1921, many of the different groups merged to become the Allgemeine Deutsche Rottweiler Club ADRK. The ADRK is now internationally recognised as the Rottweiler's official home club. The Rottweiler Club was instrumental in documenting Rottweiler history and breed standards. Rottweilers were first recognised by the American Kennel Club in 1931. The breed grew so popular that Rottweilers were on display at Crufts in the United Kingdom by 1936. The breed was assigned a distinct registry in 1966. When the American Kennel Club recognised the breed, demand for the Rottweilers reached an all-time high. The Rottweiler was named the ninth most popular pure breed dog in the United States by the American Kennel Club in 2013. There are currently just a few professional Rottweiler breeders who import pure breed Rottweilers from Europe. Buyers must use extreme caution while purchasing Rottweiler puppies in the United States in order to avoid scams. To prevent the many Rottweiler puppy cons, Rottweiler buyers should only buy their Rottweiler puppy from a competent, ethical breeder who is willing to demonstrate all health testing and pedigree. Size and appearance. Their colour is frequently black with distinct rust marks. According to AKC breed standards, Rottweilers can weigh between 80 and 135 pounds and stand 22 to 27 inches high at the shoulder. Looking at the parent pups is the simplest approach to determine a Rottweiler's complete size when grown up. Of course, when adopting a puppy from a shelter, this is not always possible. If you choose to adopt a pet from a breeder, they will be able to shed some light on the size of the parent pups as well as the size of the puppies in each litter. Feeding your Rottweiler puppy a high quality large breed puppy formula is a smart method to support appropriate growth and development and decrease the likelihood of joint problems developing. When it comes to projecting a Rottweiler puppy's full grown size, gender can make a big difference. Male Rottweilers are often taller and heavier than female Rottweilers. Temperament and characteristics. 
If you properly care for your Rottweiler, he will be your wonderful and compassionate friend. This breed's friendliness in nature makes him an all-round caring dog who will protect his family with loyalty if he sees the need. The Rottweiler is undeniably powerful and when protecting himself, he can cause harm, which is why the breed must be properly socialised and cared for from a young age. He is not an aggressive breed as some may imagine, but because of his size, many people who are unfamiliar with Rottweilers may feel he is. In reality, an aggressive Rotty is usually the result of irresponsible ownership, a lack of training or abuse. If not properly educated or mistreated, a huge, strong breed like the Rotty can be a dangerous breed. Like any other breed, a Rottweiler can become violent if he feels threatened or anxious. These practices can cause lots of new issues for you and your family. If you realise that your Rottweiler is being aggressive towards you and your family, it is important that you obtain training assistance right away. Training and Intelligence Contrary to popular belief, Rottweilers are easier to train than many other breeds. This is owing to their capacity to learn quickly and their innate obedience and receptability to proper teaching and guidance. It is your responsibility as a Rottweiler owner to train and teach your dog what is appropriate and beneficial behaviour. They will not learn this on their own. They will require your leadership to keep them on track. If your Rottweiler exhibits aggressive or bad behaviour, you must train them on how to control their emotions. This is not an easy undertaking, but because the Rottweiler is such a loyal and obedient breed, they will most likely do whatever you tell them. They will be aggressive if you train them to be so. If you teach them to be soft and kind, they will gladly follow your lead and simply be a friend. If you love dogs like we do and want to see more videos about all the amazing dogs in the world, please be sure to like and subscribe to the channel so you'll be notified about all our future videos. Exercise and Agility Rottweilers are active, strong canines who require daily exercise. Physical activity is vital for their health and happiness. Remember that regular exercise is essential for keeping your Rottweiler temperament in check. They are a lively breed with a lot of activity needs. They, like us, can experience boredom and melancholy. You will have no trouble controlling your Rottweiler's temperament if you provide plenty of toys to play with, plenty of time to run and play, and positive attention. Swimming or running might be excellent ways for them to expend their pent-up energy. A healthy adult Rottweiler may require one to two hours of exercise every day. Daily walking, vigorous exertion and mental stimulation should all be included. The Rottweiler is an energetic working breed, although his exercise requirements will vary depending on his age, health and energy level. Shedding and grooming. Rottweilers shed all year, with more shedding in the spring when they lose old hair that was replaced by new fur over the winter. They may also be prone to seasonal allergies, which may lead to additional shedding. Personal grooming for Rottweilers is often recommended every four to eight weeks. You are to clean the ears, cut nails, check anal glands, and ensure that the coat and skin are both in good shape. Clear, alert, and bright eyes are required for optimal health. Health and lifespan. Stomach and digestive problems are the simplest and most common problems that affect your Rottweiler's general health. Fortunately, they are usually minor concerns with straightforward solutions. Even better, prevention is simple, only if a digestive problem persists. You should consult your Rotty's veterinarian only if the problem persists. Owning a Rottweiler is a thrilling and unique experience. They have a 10 year lifetime, and I know it's your desire as a responsible pet owner to pack as much quality into those years as possible for your pup. If you are thinking of getting a Rotty, then we are all sure you will have a lot of fun spending time with this loyal partner. Remember, your dog's health is very important, so stay on top of things and you'll be good to go. So, what do you think of the amazing Rottweiler? Would you consider getting one? Perhaps you've had the pleasure of owning one already? Let us know in the comments below. Once again, thanks so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one.